Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is a question for Bluefish users. Specifically, I'm on uh, Linux Mint 12. Uh, I've noticed on this video here, uh, you can see that the under Bluefish, the text is highlighted, or rather there is some sort of, you know, there's a difference in colors. HTML is dark blue, script is dark blue type, and then it's kind of purplish, and then text is red. Uh, I'm not getting that same features here. Uh, let's save it just for giggles and see if that's the problem. Hmm. Test.html. Ah, okay. So that's how you get the um, that's how you get the coding to recognize itself. You have to declare the tag. You have to save it. Uh, let's take a look at this and see if it's going to take care of itself for me. I'm going to put this in between script negative. I'll try removing okay now I've got some highlighting it's not very good though um, with JavaScript in fact it's not very good at all and I'm not quite sure how to fix it HTML editor to settings yeah and output external filters anyway it looks like I'm gonna have to play around here more than I wanted to get the tag to get the coding right and I also need uh, Let's see, it's under JavaScript. Okay, so all of these are loaded. Um, okay, brackets are brackets, but how do I get the colors to change? And I'd really like, okay, foreground color, block match, special warning. Here's a bunch of them here. What I really like to do is get the size of the of the um, cancel, get the size of the text increased. Anyway, uh, just a little FYI: if you want some code highlighting with Bluefish, you have to save the document first. Thank you for watching, and uh, I appreciate anybody who is Bluefish specialist to post a video on how to get more out of uh, Bluefish in terms of code highlighting. Thank you and happy computing.